Welcome to my channel, it's Matt the Garden and Lawn Care Guy here and today we're going to show you the step-by-step -step process to do a full lawn renovation. This is a fantastic lawn, it's in need of a bit of TLC but we're going to show you how to get to a result like this including scarification, aeration, top dress, seed and some fertiliser so stick around for the rest of the video just to see how we get going. So for this job we've got three main bits of kit, this soil spreader here this is a very nice bit of kit um, stick around and we'll show you how that works in uh, in a little bit and then the other two bits of kit we've got is a hollow tine aerator and this scarify here so the first step of the process is around aeration we're using a hollow tine aeration which helps pull some plugs out of the soil and it can help relieve compaction and give a nice seedbed for the soil to for the seed to sit in. This particular lawn um, has had a hard time over the winter. There's lots of trees and shade and quite a bit of debris that's dropped on it and it's definitely in need of a spring renovation. We're going to go through the whole process and do a follow-up video to see how the results. So if you're interested in that, please subscribe to the channel and you'll see the follow-up results. You can see actually the compaction isn't that bad on this lawn. It's come up um, quite well after an aggressive aeration and all of these little plugs that are just pulled out of the lawn. You can see these little plugs here. It's a clay kind of loam and that's going to give a really nice bed for the seed to sit in. When we're doing the scarification of the lawn we're going to do it in two passes and um, it's always best to do that where you take a first pass not too heavy and deep and then uh, we're just adjusting the blade down a little bit you can do that by just adjusting these adjusters here and drop it down a little bit So that was the scarification part and the uh, scarification is designed to um, just remove any uh, thatch that's left in the soil um, and help create a bit of a better seed bed for the seed to sit in. Now you can see for this particular lawn there isn't much grass there in the first place so the soil is breaking up really nicely and it is a little bit muddy. However, this is going to give us a really good bed for seed to soil contact when we do put the seed down and I can't wait to see how this one turns out, it's going to look amazing. If 
if we just have a little look around the lawn you can see some of the plugs that the machines pulled up and kind of little tracks that the scarifiers made and these little tracks are ideal uh, safe place for the seed to sit in you can see overall from the amount of debris coming up there isn't too much thatch in this lawn um, but we've got a really good working surface now to uh, start the next step of the process. After the scarification, we're going to just rake up some of the debris. Um, this is just going to take any of the matter out of the soil and uh, then we're going to prepare for another scarification a little bit deeper this time just to cut into that soil ready for the seeds to sit in that soil zone. So now the lawn surface is all prepared, we're going to start the overseeding process. I'm going to do a nice uh, generous uh, overseed to get this lawn thickened up and within around anywhere between two to four weeks depending on the weather, this lawn is going to look absolutely fantastic. There's loads of soil so we've got a good seed to soil contact which is really important for germination and um, can't wait to see how it looks. After we've done the seeding and top dressing, we're just putting a bit of fertiliser down and the fertiliser is going to help push the growth, help the seeds to germinate and really boost this lawn into the spring. So we can see the guys done an absolutely stunning job on this lawn. Looks super healthy. Really nice quality seed. And a nice quality top dress that's going to feed that lawn and help protect it from the birds. So let's go and take a little bit look, a look closer what's going on. Really nice and generous application of seed. Birds are coming around already for the for breakfast. And we're going to be doing a follow up on this lawn in a couple of weeks time just so you can see um, some of the really good quality results we're going to get. So uh, if you're interested in that and you've enjoyed this video, please give me a like and subscribe to the channel for more lawn care content. This is Matt, the Garden and Lawn Care Guy and thanks for watching.